Bye. <laughs>
Right, let's get rid of the horde. Uh, let's have it. Horde. Right. We need stock vent like that. It's obviously not going to be like the Shelby GT500 like Eleanor type one, but we'll go. We'll go with it and see if we can make it. Hmm. Go with that. Looks nicer. Plate. We'll go with that and then too slow. Respray. So we need like a metal, don't we? Oh, that goes well. Secondary metal. There we go. Trim color. I think it looks nice and black, really. Roll cage. I'm not going to put a roll cage in it because we're trying to keep it classic, aren't we? Doesn't do anything for me anyway, so it's not like it's needed. Roof, imagine if you could take the roof off, how cool that would actually be. We'll keep the roof like that. Skirts. Uh, yeah, we'll go with that. Spoiler. No, we don't want to obviously any massive spoiler, so it, no, just keep it normal. Suspension. If I drop it, what happens? No, we'll just drop it then. Transmission, obviously, we want. Turbo, we obviously want. Now, wheels, this is always the hardest to pick. Now, actually, I've got to make some statement here that this is actually probably the best car for customization in a while. Transmission, no, we don't do that. Custom, we don't do that. We'll do that too, just for the sake of it. And we'll go back to liveries quickly. Where, where is L? Livery, right. That's that. Could have that. We could have. Oh. Do you want that? No. Yeah, we're going to stick with that. Right, okay. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to go back to the runway and we are going to test it. So, we'll get back to you when we get back to the runway. Okay, we are now back at the runway. We're just going to go through the gates now. Should open up. And there we go. Right, and now I'm uh, I'm not going to say anything. I know how cool this car is. We're not going to spoil it or anything. A lot of you have probably seen the car, but we're going to... Uh, for those that haven't seen it, are going to see it for the first time ever. We're not going to spoil it for them by speeding off now, showing what it can do before we hit the runway. We'll start off here. Get past... Yeah, and then we'll go, three, two, one, go, right, okay, now you're going to see how cool this car is and how fast it can actually go. Look at that, that is some speed for a car, especially a sports classic, and then the handling, we'll test here. And that is perfect. Okay, this is actually pretty cool. This is a lot better than I thought it was going to be. And can we get this corner? Yes, we can. And can we hit this one? Yep, that's perfect. As long as we don't hit the dirt, we're fine. Now we're going to floor it back down here. Just how look how amazing this car is. And then look at the speed of it. Oh, handling is amazing in this car. That will go this way. Change up a bit. And what I'm going to start doing, guys, is on my next video, will be me going around the Nürburgring. Basically, it's the Nürburgring. Obviously, I'm saying it wrong because I'm not German and I'm not very good at pronouncing things, as you guys know. But uh, I've basically made my own. Well, I've not made. I've found one. It looks good and it, it basically is a good a good one and basically what we're going to do is we're going to show you how quick laps can go and we're going to make a lap track so i'm going to basically make a lap time for each each car that goes around we'll get a lap time and it'll be a bit like top gear and that where it gets a lap lap time and it's really good and everything but uh it's going to be on my own style and uh it's basically going to be going around my own version of a, of a nerve ring track and then maybe if we progress and people start to like this series then maybe We'll make our own track 
and you guys can then help me make that track or I'll let you guys make the track and then send me it and then I will obviously then do a review on that track then if you have a channel or anything you want to publicize then obviously I'll make a big thing about that and then we'll go onto your track and race around it and that'll be our new track but obviously you know we need to uh, we need to just start off slowly and we'll start with this car and this video will come out and then the Nürburgring video will come out now it is 9.20 Friday night now hopefully I'm hoping I can get this edited quickly and sometimes I know that my videos can take 24 hours to edit I don't know why and then I'll wake up the next day and they'll only have like 3, 4 to 6, 7 hours left so if I can I'll get it out to you as soon as I can but I'm going to make as many videos as I can over the weekend and then I can have the rest of the week videos coming out for you and then whenever I have time I'll make a video for you now I know I've been really bad at making videos for you this week I don't think I've had a video out at all I think I may have had one or two but I'm sorry I'm gonna get straight back to it guys and please don't worry the channel is not gonna die we are gonna just gonna keep working on it but a few issues here and there you know monetization I'm just gonna be open and honest here For some reason it's been suspended we don't know why it says because of paying people to come on the channel but I don't get enough views for that to legally be on an understatement because when you click on it it does say that you have you for someone that gets paid pays for views that I do not do because I, I couldn't do that and I don't have the time to go through my own channel and watch my own videos I want to go onto my channel the only time I will watch my videos is when I'm editing them finish editing them or if it's a live stream that doesn't get edited I'll watch it on my own laptop, I'll download it and watch it on my laptop so it doesn't even count as a view. Because obviously I try to keep YouTube as fair as I can and obviously I get treated like this. But we're just going to work through it guys and we're going to deal with it. Not that I was making any money on YouTube anyway, let's be open and honest, you don't make much money on YouTube as a small channel. But I like doing it for the views, making you guys laugh whenever I can and obviously I know that it helps when I have my friends like Lewis and Ryan and... Daniel and Anthony and Michael and the rest of them are all there helping. But for now, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to do one more lap and you can see how good this car is. And then we're going to end it there. And we're going to go. Then I'm going to go and record the Nürburgring for you once I've edited this. Because obviously, I want to make sure I try and get this video out for Saturday morning, maybe Saturday afternoon. But please bear with me. Uh, and also, the last thing I'd like to say is that yes. In the live stream that you see, we, we do get a bit, um, how do I say this? We lose attention very quickly due to, um, what do I say for this? Due to the air show. Yeah, the air show, the night air show that went on tonight, and we were just watching it from our rooms. We ended up finishing a recording because we just lost focus, and then we've gone off now and done our own things the rest of the night. I'm going to finish recording, guys, as much as I can tonight. So obviously I want to try and get as much good content as you can. So, I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you've liked this video and a nice little car review of the Debachi. Now, what we'll do is we'll just park up here nicely. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, press the notification button down below for instant notifications. And I'll see you guys.